Coach, 30 turnovers today for your squad, make it 31 at the end. That's obviously a factor in the loss. A tough one against a team that you've beaten before. What was your impression of today's game? Well, just very much what you said. I thought we had so many unforced turnovers. Um, you know, obviously we know they're in a zone and, and um, is zone press and, and, and zone in the half court. And, and we, ju we just didn't read where our passes were. You know, we just kind of, they, they, they spread their zone out a lot. So instead of penetrating or looking for interior passes, um, we were trying to pass around the perimeter and that's, that they were playing the lanes. So, you know, I just thought in the first half, 17, and now it's, and then it's <laughs> whatever, the, whatever the math is on that, 14, I guess. You know, there's just way too many turnovers. And, and it, was, it was more than, it was like bobbled passes and we didn't catch we didn't catch a, a full court pass in transition and it was and it was right there and we threw the ball out of bounds a couple times and we threw it right to um on our sideline break twice i think we threw it right to the next person in line and instead of reading where it was so i just didn't think we were didn't have a you know i mean i i thought we played hard i thought we were invested i didn't uh i didn't think we boxed out very well even though we had a pretty big um, rebounding advantage. I thought in the second in the second half they got a lot of offensive rebounds. They, they see they end up with 21 for the game, and I just didn't think we were very mentally sharp today. Uh, they didn't do one thing that we didn't expect, and they didn't do one thing that we hadn't prepped yesterday in practice. But I just didn't think we were very good basketball players today in terms of making fundamental reads and fundamental things like pass and catch and and basket cut so I think that's more of it and and then of course the fouls piled up they they have 25 points from from the three-point line in the second half we got a little bit better at some of the switching that we were trying to do but you know at the end of the day we just made way too many mistakes today um, to win a basketball game Jamira shoots one for one in the first half really turned it on after halftime do you like the way that she responded to kind of a quiet first half yeah, I did. I mean, she was in foul trouble. So, I mean, she got, I think she got her first foul with eight minutes to go in the first quarter. Um, and so, you know, it's really hard to, to put a player back in the game when they have two fouls in the, in the first half. Um, I mean, they all think that they're not going to foul, but, um, but they get caught in difficult positions and, and they're competitive and they, they want to make a play. So we put her in there for a little bit, but we couldn't leave her in there very long because we needed her to be aggressive. Um, in the second half. I thought she did a great job of getting the ball when she when she was aggressive at getting the ball in the middle of the floor. I thought she did a great job. Thanks, Coach. I know this is a tough one. We'll yep. see you home. Thank you. That's Melissa McFerrin.